Welcome to Storytime with Miss LaPerry. Today's story is Earrings, ran by Judith Fios, illustrated by Nola Lagner Malone. I want them, I need them, I love them. I've got to have them. My mom and my dad won't let me have them. Earrings, beautiful earrings for pierced ears. Teachers and lady dentists have them. Mothers and even grandmothers have them. Why won't my mom and my dad let me have pierced ears? They say that I'm too young. I'm not too young. I'm actually very mature for my age. I clear the plates after dinner. I take a shower without even being told. They say that I need to be patient. I've tried being patient. I'm tired of patient. I want my ears pierced now, not when I'm 20, 40, 80, 100 years old. I want them, I need them, I love them. Beautiful earrings, glorious earrings. My mom and my dad say, wait for a couple years. I tell them I'm the only girl in my class, in my school, in the world, in the solar system, whose mom and dad won't let her have pierced ears. At your age, they say, pierced ears are premature. I hate premature. At your age, they say pierced ears are inappropriate. I really hate inappropriate. At your age, they say, pierced ears look a little tacky. I can't believe I've got such old-fashioned parents. I want them. I need them. I love them. Beautiful earrings. Glorious earrings. My mom and my dad keep saying weird things like, why? Because they'd make me look good. Because they'd make me feel good. And because furthermore, I'd be so proud of wearing them. I'd stand up straight and hold my head up high, which means that they would also be good for my posture. And I hear that they keep your earlobes warm in winter. My mom and my dad ask, what do you want for your birthday? I tell them what I want for my birthday. Pierce ears. My mom and my dad ask, what do you want for Christmas? I tell them that I only want pierce ears. And what do you think I say when they ask me, what should we bring you back from our vacation? I say earrings, beautiful earrings, glorious earrings, beautiful, glorious earrings for pierced ears. Instead of earrings, they say, we could get you a locket. I don't want a locket. Instead of earrings, they say, we could get you a charm bracelet. I really don't want a charm bracelet. As a substitute for earrings, they say, we brought you back this. Don't they understand? There isn't any substitute for earrings. I want them, I need them, I love them. Beautiful earrings, glorious earrings. I argue and beg and sometimes there's yelling and tears. I tell my mom and my dad all the things I would do. If only, if only, if only, if only, if only they would let me have pierced ears. Like walk our dog every day for one whole year. Like clean up my room every day for one whole year. Like read a book once a week for one whole year. Like be nice to my little brother for one whole year. Well, maybe six months. And I wouldn't ask for new clothes because I could wear the same old clothes and just change my earrings. I want them. I need them. I love them. I keep telling my mom and my dad I've got to have them. My mom and my dad say they're tired of hearing this stuff. But I promise, I promise, I promise, I cross my heart, I promise that they'll never hear it again the minute they decide I'm old enough. For earrings, beautiful earrings, glorious earrings. Beautiful, glorious earrings for pierced ears. The end. Thanks for reading along with me today. Remember to subscribe below to hear more stories. Have the best day and remember to keep reading.